guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a Birchbox versus Ipsy haul, unboxing, and review. I'm going to test some of them on my face, the makeup products that I got. So if you want to see that video, then just keep watching. So first, we're going to go ahead and do Birchbox. So this month, um, the box is really cute, and it comes with, of course, the um, card to tell you all the details of everything in the box. So first thing I did try out is the uh, Marcel CC Cream in Golden Glow. So when I put this on, I realized um, obviously CC creams are not supposed to have the fullest of coverage, but it didn't have that much coverage, but the color was perfect for my skin. So I did really like that, and um, I'll have to be trying this out a little bit more to be able to give my full opinion on it, but for now, it isn't a bad CC cream. It's for one of those probably makeup, no makeup, makeup days. And it does have SPF 35, so if you're going to be out in the sun, that's really good. The next product that I did use is the Beautinique Beauty Blush Serum in Sunrise. This is a very bright pink. Um, full size is $16. Also, that um, BB cream, or no, CC cream is $33 full size. Um, this one is... I don't think this is the full size, but it is a lot because you didn't have to use a lot. So whenever I put this on, it's kind of like a squeeze out. It is a liquid, oh, that was way too much. It's a liquid blush. And I'll go ahead and put this on my hand. And as you can tell, it's very bright. And I don't think this is the right color for my skin tone. If I was a little more pale, this would look really pretty. Um, I have it right here on my cheek, and it, I don't like it. It's like a petal pink, um, and that's not my kind of blush that I usually go for. Um, I might have to try it on a no makeup makeup day and maybe it'll look really pretty but I don't like this color. If it was a coral, which is what I usually wear, it would have been much prettier but this is not not my color. So the next thing in here is this um, Michael Todd Charcoal Detox Deep Pore Gel Cleanser. The full size is $23. Um, let me open this up and get a little... Oh. It has a nice little um, safety seal. Perfect. Ooh. Yeah, it smells like charcoal. It's like um, dark gray. Ooh, it's like black. You can see the dot of it. It's very thick. Um, it's probably one of those foamy cleansers, so I'll have to try this out, but I'm kind of looking forward to that. I'm really liking all the charcoal um, stuff that's come out in the beauty world right now. So the next thing I see in here is a hair product. It is the Amica Undone Texture Spray. And um, full size of this is $24. It says for a boost of body and tousel texture, sans stickiness, miss this styling spray. Let's see if I can smell what it smells like. I'll spray it on the cap. Ooh. <coughs> Ooh. It smells like hairspray. That's it. That's what it smells like. A little bit like perfumey, actually. Um, I'll have to show a clip of me trying this out in my hair today because it is kind of natural today, so y'all will see that. But I don't really... I put in my birch box like a profile that I wanted hair and face and beauty stuff, but I kind of really only just want beauty stuff after getting that stuff and realizing I don't want it. So um, this is cute, and I probably will use this, but I probably will take that off of my profile now to just get beauty stuff. So the next thing on the list is the Avene Cleanance Expert full size is $26. This is I believe a moisturizer. It says it moisturizes and mattifies all while reducing redness and preventing future breakouts. Oh, I should use this today. So that was Birchbox for this month. I got two beauty products, two uh, skincare products, and one hair product. Okay guys, for Ipsy this month, it came in a golden bag. Um, this is actually my first Ipsy subscription like month, I guess. So um, they did include like a, you know, tell all about the Ipsy box. Y'all don't need to see that, it doesn't really matter, but um, in this box, it came with two Tony Moly masks, and I did haul these previously in my Mar Marshalls haul. I'll put that um, linked in the description down below, and I'll try and put it up here too, so you can see that. Um, I did have two different types of these, and they were really nice. I, I haven't tried the poor one yet, so I'll have to try that, but these two look awesome. This is 
One is uh, I'm Real Lotus Mask Sheet in Illuminating. And one is I'm Real Green Tea Mask Sheet in Skin Purifying. So I'll have to try those out. Those are fun to do. I love sheet masks. And it came in this really cute Goudé Tama bag. And look at his little booty on the back. It's so cute. Oh my gosh, that's really cute. I'm kind of liking it see better just, just from this bag. Um, okay, so here's the little, it came with a card. It says, hey there sleepyhead, blah, blah, blah. Lazy Sunday vibes are here because, you know, Goody Tama is a lazy egg. Um, first thing I see is this Avene. Hey, we got the um, moisturizer, I guess, of that in the birch box. So that's pretty funny. This is a matte lotion mattifying toner. Well, that's pretty cool. Let's see the consistency of this. Yeah, it's like a, it's a liquid toner. So that's pretty cool. So you do get one skincare thing in here. Well, this is the first thing, I don't know. Yeah, okay, it's only that. That's the only skincare besides Tony Moly. Okay, three skincare. Um, and then this NYX blush, this HD blush. Um, is this HD blush? Yeah in Double Dare. It's this really, really bright orange, and this is gorgeous. I also used this in a video that will uh, be going up after this, but um, this was so pretty. I have it on this side of my face today, and I love this color. I usually go for a, um, not orange, but a coral, and so this is really nice if you brush in and then tap off the excess, put that on. Um, that's absolutely gorgeous, and the color payoff is amazing i used it on my eyes in the next video and it's so beautiful i can't i can't next thing is the ciate wonderland gel coal liner and it's two-sided so one side is the tip which is very very black and then the other side is this brush so you can um you can blend out the color i guess and just make it very blendy i don't know um, but I used this on my eyes today, and it was really nice to make a cat eye with it because you kind of got a very um, natural cat eye. It's not like super in your face, but it's still very pretty and very natural. And I do love how creamy this is. It went on perfectly on my inner um, inner rim waterline, upper waterline. I don't know what that technical term is, but that part of my eye went on really well. And yeah, overall, I think that's just like a really good product to put in the bag. And so next, we've got this Cougar 24-hour uh, liquid lipstick in the color Mulberry. And that is what is on my lips today. Um, it is just a very, like, purpley color. I wouldn't consider this to be a summer color. There are other colors on the side of the box, which I wish that they would have given me maybe, like, I don't know, the, the bright pink down here or, like, this coral orange. Um, but, I mean, this is a nice fall color. I do think, however, that it's super dry like very 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 drying and in the other video when I used this it created like a white cast like the inside of my lip was darker than this part of my lip which was like ashy and white and I did not like how that looked so I don't like this product this is a no-go for me I I didn't like it it's not not the best matte lipstick I like my Milani matte lipsticks a lot better than this and um, I mean for coming in the pack it's a really good idea to put a liquid lipstick in it but this was just not the right product for me I did not like it so for this month who do y'all think won Ipsy Birchbox Ipsy Birchbox Ipsy won definitely Ipsy um, and okay that is kind of like biased because I need to change my Birchbox to be only um, only makeup products and then we can have a fair shot but um starting off with Birchbox like this was good like I don't really care for skincare products because I already have a solid skincare routine um y'all comment down below if you would like to see that but um skincare products are like meh to me I don't really care I don't really care for those this blush serum was too light for me so I don't like that and the CC cream was good um but not really what I would prefer um, the Ipsy starting off, it started off real strong with Tony Moly Mask, which I already know I love. Um, the Goudé Tama bag, like you can't, this bag is so freaking cute. I can't. And um, 
Yes, there was one skincare product. Um, I'll try it out. I mean, I don't really care for it. But this blush was amazing. This eyeliner was amazing. This lip lipstick was not good. It wasn't good. So, um, I mean, how many products is that? Four, four out of six products I did like from the Ipsy. So I have to say that Ipsy won for this month. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, give me a like, comment down below, and um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.